Hey guys, in this video, I will answer all of the questions that you guys sent out via Facebook because you all know this. I've been getting a lot of messages and because I've been super busy, I really don't get to have the time to answer all of the messages that you guys sent me. So in this video, that's what we will talk about and that's what we will focus on. So to those of you who sent your questions, this video is for you. Check this video out. Hi everyone, this is Marvin Germo. If you're new to this channel, Please subscribe and smash that bell so you get updated every time I create new content about the stock market. So enjoy! Anyways, as promised, I'm gonna go through all of your questions. Here are the messages that you guys sent out. I'm gonna try to answer at least 10 to probably 25 depending on the pacing, depending on uh, how this will normally go, no? So if there's a lot of questions and it takes a lot of time for me to answer, I'll answer lesser questions. But if there's a lot of, if it's uh, if it's easy to answer, then we, we could probably put more and more of this in the vlog. Because you all, you all know the reason why I do this is just, I just really want to help you guys out. I want to create frameworks on how Filipinos can invest and win and trade. So let's do this first. Number one, first question. Evander... On the on the villa, are you available to chat? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. So, eto na yun. Next, uh, Joseph uh, Barbosa, are you available to chat, sir? San po pwede mag invest? Of course, uh, question here's the thing, no technique pala, by the way. If you want to send questions to me, uh, via all of this, is basically make, make it straight already because I, I, I have I most likely won't be able to see all of your questions already or bakandi ko na siya mabalikan. So, San Pwede Mag Invest, I've created so many videos about that. But a quick answer is basically this you have to find an investment that fits you. You have to find an investment that fits your timeline, your horizon, your risk tolerance, the capital that you have, the ability for you to monitor it. And you double down on something that you believe that you know you're very, very good at. It doesn't make sense investing in Bitcoin if you're not doing well at it or if you don't understand it. The worst thing that you could ever do is to put your money in Bitcoin because a lot of people are putting their money there. Do not enter an investment just because everyone else is going into it if it does not make sense for you if you do not know what it is if you cannot understand it then it does not make sense don't go into it i hope i answered your question joseph if you have a follow-up question just send it again next michael mendoza are you available to chat yes i am michael mendoza good afternoon sir just watch your video about uitf i'm interested about this idea for investment my question is which bank is good for uitf is there is it any different from any bank so here's the thing each bank ha has different products meaning some of them have you have particular fund managers also and they have particular uh they have particular funds dependent depending on the bank majority of them which is common and which is almost the same is a lot of them have index equity funds meaning they track the index a lot of them have specific equity funds which uh, it's at the discretion of the fund manager already on what stock they're supposed to buy then they have bond funds and they have balance funds which on balance funds naman the whole narrative of balance funds is they basically just follow and copy where the index uh where, where if the stock market is doing well they will put more stock they will put more cash in the stock market if the bond market is doing better or they believe the stock market will go down then they're gonna position more on bonds as compared to stocks so my suggestion there is this look at the philosophies of the fund managers look at their track record also and you go for the most consistent one uh you can go or you can start with the banks that you have already wherever you have an account you can check with them already because you have a relationship with them as well next uh si lomart and brosha santa i i know what this is already because i made a post all about santa uh, if a Santa rally will, if a Santa Claus rally will happen this December, uh, the link is already in my YouTube channel. The video is already there. You have Ave Guillermo. Hello, Marvin. I've been a follower. I've been following your YouTube channel since you started, I've, and I've almost seen all your videos. Whoa, talaga! All, One thousand plus videos. Huh? This is so interesting. I'm looking for a mentor and wanted to ask you if you still have time, or if you can connect me to someone who have who has the same expertise as you in terms of stocks. And investment stinks in advance. By the way, I'm living in Ortigas and work in Makati. Oh, okay, thank you for that question, Ave Guillermo. No. So here, here's the thing. Uh, time is really constrained for me over the past. Uh, it's been a constraint over the past few years because uh, 
there's so many things that I do as well. Apart from uh, the normal things that you guys see on YouTube, there are other things that you don't see also that take a lot of my time. And here's my suggestion. Uh, Apart from mentoring one-on-one, -on -one, which takes a lot of time, my suggestion first, and a lot, and a lot of people who attended our Stock Smart sessions could uh, adhere to this. Number one, uh, you can attend the sessions first because uh, most of the time, most of the questions that people ask or most of the things that they need to refine on how they would trade, how they would, they would invest, have, can be answered and will be addressed already on the sessions. So that's my suggestion. The next session that we will have most likely will be 2020. That will be around March. Then... After that, if you have any questions during the event, uh, you want something that you would want to talk to one-on-one, -on -one, you can ask me there. Na lang din. I think that's one of the most efficient ways for us to be able to uh, talk more about it and help you as well. Now, let's continue. Siyak ni Eton. Are you available to chat? Everyone's asking if I'm available to chat. I am. It's just that I don't have as much time. So again, my suggestion after putting are you available to chat, ask now what question you wanted me to ask to begin with. Uh... Christina Lubaton, can you tell me more about yourself? I have a video also posted uh, telling me more about myself and my backstory as well. But for those who would like to know, uh, basically, uh, I I graduated as an engineer, took the board exam, never practiced a single day in my life. I was in the corporate world for five years. But while I was in the corporate world, I was doing a combination of business, investing, and creating multiple sources of our revenue streams for me and then uh, among all of the investments that I uh, that I went into the stock market was my favorite and up to this day it's still uh, one of the things that I love to do as well next Ephraim Bustos I have zero knowledge about the stock market but want to start what is the first book that I should buy by the way nasa UK kasi ako meron bang ebook just in case uh, so I, I think making ebooks will be in my pipeline over the next uh, few years uh, it's not something yet that I have as of this point in time. Uh, my suggestion, if you want to get a copy, uh, links are down below sa Shopee uh, or via my online store. Uh, what you can do is you can have it delivered uh, to you can have it delivered to uh, a friend who's in the Philippines that's going to the UK soon, and then they can send that they can send the books to you. Or you can transact it from there. That's the easiest and most cost-effective way. But it can be shipped also to the UK. It's just that the costs are more effective. But uh, I'm gonna put a link also down below for if you want to join us because I'm I'm planning to do stock smarts again in London this April. So uh, for those who want to join that as well, I'm gonna send. I'm gonna try to put a link in the description so that we get to see more Filipinos who are from London or at least in the UK area join us. Next, Ephraim Bustos. I have zero knowledge, but one. Zero knowledge about stock market, but want to start. Uh, by by the way, nasa UK. I answered that. Tapala. Okay. I'm confused. I'm sorry, Ephraim. Okay, next. Kiefer Sabala. Hey, Marvin. Been watching your vlogs for the past months. I'm wondering if an employee could make a video on what are the things that an employee can do with 100,000 pesos. Like what Graham Stephen did. I'll try to search who this person is. I Mohang American. Also, a personal question for me is... How could I explore more options of investing in business if I've only limited circle of people that share the same sentiments? Um, those are, so basically two questions. Number one, you have to increase your circle. So that means also your current friends like right now might not be the friends that will take you where you want to go as well. So yeah, the best way to do it is attend expos, attend conventions, attend seminars, attend areas where you will meet people that most likely have the same mindset as you. And that's what I did also before. Uh, most of my friends uh, that I... that that I had at that time weren't really into investing, weren't really into business. So I would, I, would, I had a chance also to meet a lot of people that had the same mindset from me, uh, from all of those events that I attended. So ganun din, try to meet more people, try to explore. Uh, you also have to uh, change the way you perceive things uh, because also who you spend the most time with will dictate your destiny. It will dictate also what you do. They will, they will also influence you in certain degrees. Uh, okay, I'll try to make a video about that for 100,000 pesos, but I'll try to answer it very, very quick also right here, right now. You double down on something that you know you're already good at. So if you have 100,000 pesos and you think you're good at uh, flipping stuff, use the 100,000 into flipping. If you're good at the stock market, put more in the stock market. You want to put in more money into something that you know is doing well. You want to put in money into something that you know uh, is uh, somehow, no, somehow, some way, uh, 
have 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 the ability to give you a greater amount of return. But if you're trying to discover it still and you don't know uh, what it is yet, my my suggestion is this: you chop that into smaller amounts and try to experiment, try to practice, try to dabble into stocks a bit, try to dabble into global stocks a bit as well. Try to use a small amount of that capital also to do some side hustles, some small businesses. So at least you get to discover what works for you. And then when you start discovering what works for you, that's when you put more money and you double down on it. I hope I answered your question. Next, Alice Perez. Uh, good evening, Sir Marvin. Are you going to visit Milan? I uh, saw so you were the Tower of Pisa if ever we can meet. Uh, that was that uh, what I do because there's a lot of travel pictures, so I try to curate them and put them on, on different posts as well. But I don't know if I have any schedule uh, to go into Italy over the next few months. But I think the closest that will be uh, most likely will be London or some if ever Germany or that that area above uh, above Italy. So if you want to join us, I'll put the link below also. So. You get updated on uh, whenever an event will happen in that area. So, link will be in the description. Yanni Selemen. Hi, uh, my name is Yanni. I'm seven years old. Can I ask something? I have some money for my birthday party, but it's only 200 dirhams. How much should I spend? How much should I should I invest? How much should I save? Thank you. Uh, wow, galeng, seven year old kid uh, having at least the 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 interest on saving investing and what to do about it uh it's that's nice to see you know that's so that's just so amazing i i love to see kids uh have that kind of mindset because if i if i knew this when i was younger i would have started investing as well i would have saved up as well i would have doubled down more i would have put in as much as i can on investing so here's my suggest suggestion uh you turn the deer up sand Please remember, don't say na 200 dirhams lang. It's still an amount. It's seed. And here's one thing that I know. Harvest is always greater than seed. As harvest is always greater than seed, put it in, put it in, invest it. If you want to also, you set aside a small amount not from that 200 dirhams that you think you na okay na sayo to enjoy by a toy or a kid. Uh, you also need to enjoy life as well. But above and beyond that, on top of all of that, you invest you double down you put in as much as you can right here right now learn the rudiments of investing in the stock market learn how to invest and mas maganda nga mag invest sa stock market habang bata kasi kung habang bata ka pa even if you make a mistake you still have enough runway to help you recoup whatever uh, errors that you may possibly have as well i hope i answered that question and if you're seven years old also i hope that uh, this is something that uh, this is something that would help you so rj uh satyada my video for 10K mutual fund contest is loading, loading Google Drive. Yeah, just send it lang. By the way, uh, deadline for your entries for the 10,000 peso mutual fund giveaway will be tomorrow. So I hope you guys send it and I hope it gets posted. I hope you guys get to uh, wa watch your entries as well. Uh, next, Lea Galura Mariano. I saw a banner in my broker that there's a follow-on offering of Century Property Group Incorporated preferred shares at... 6.7177 per annum par values 0.53 per share offer is 100 pesos per share minimum 500 shares thereafter in multiples of 100 shares i plan to buy 1000 shares or 100,000 worth questions uh, is it fixed? Yes, it's fixed. So that's what's nice about preferred shares. It gives you an expectation that you can expect a, a rate of return. So, uh, basta yung, ito na lang. so to make it easier for you, uh, if you place 100,000 pesos, you will get uh, you will get 6.7177 of the 100,000 pesos that you put less 10% tax as well. So that's it. I hope I answered your question. You said, hope to receive your... Wow, demanding though. <laughs> demanding. This hope to receive your reply uh, soonest because uh, it's until December 19. Uh, so yeah, this video will be up tonight. So yeah, uh, I hope you get to watch this video as well because for sure it will be up by, by tonight and it's before the December 19 date. Next, uh, Arnold John Granda. Sir, for Gen Z like me, what do you think is the best course in college that's related to stocks? There's a lot, no? Uh, you could go management of financial institutions. That's what my wife took in La Salle. Uh, you can take anything that's related to the economy or that will gear you towards being an economist. 
or you can take accounting also so that you will be uh, very very well tuned and get in in analyzing stocks as well and valuing companies so those are my suggestions but ako my route i was an engineer uh, what's nice about being an engineer is that most of the hard math subjects in most of the financial courses in engineering uh, it's very 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 uh very 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 uh there are harder math subjects in engineering what does that do and how will it help you uh it will help you in a way because since the math subjects in engineering are hard you will get trained to learn more about logic you will learn more uh, engineers are taught to uh engineers are taught to lower uh, their susceptibility to risk we're taught to how how we can uh, prepare for the worst conditions and ayun, 100 plus units of math and physics will generally help you in general so that's it i hope i answered your question next uh chris race good morning mr marvin do you have the dates po of seminar singapore may i hope i can attend uh wala pang exact date no on when is it or when it will be but uh, it will be for sure May, most likely uh, it will be on the second or third week of May. So, wala pa. But stay tuned. Uh, we'll try to announce it this December as well. And I hope to see you there, Chris Race. Next, MJ Makayan. Sir, may takloban ba kayo? No, taklob, no takloban seminar. The closest in takloban will be probably Cebu, will be Cebu and Iloilo if we have stocks more in Iloilo. But what I am sure of is we have in, uh, we have in Cebu. Uh, broker, I've posted so many broker videos already to talk about it. I hope you were able to see it as well. Uh, next, let's see. Uh, Gerald Fai Jimmy Campos. Good PM. Paano po sumali? Please be more specific. Anong pwedeng salihin? Salihan? Romel Conti. Whoa! It's, this is long. Hello, Sir Marvin. Good evening. Isa po sa marami mong tagahanga at followers. I want to ask an advice if possible regarding investment. I jump into agri-investment at the present and at present, there's an order from SEC to stop their program due to lack of secondary license. In other words, apektado ang investment namin. It's a three-year contract and payouts were scheduled anyways. Ang option na binigay sa amin now is to convert our payments, uh, payouts to preferred shares. Contract will be terminated once converted. Sabi nila, 20 pesos per share. Current price nila, bibenta sa amin 15 per share. There are benefits that when you become a shareholder, according to them, 10% annual dividends, convertible after three years, capital gains, cumulative. The plan is to apply for an IPO as a SEC. May I know your thoughts about this? Please give me advice. Uh, DV Bauer, nako, I'm not too familiar with DV Bauer, but uh, this is what I'll do. I'll try to I'll try to ask some friends who have exposure into it and have analyzed it. I don't know what it is, uh, but I know some friends who uh, know it more than I do. So I, I normally don't comment on on some companies that I don't have any exposure in. I don't comment on things that I don't know. I just stay in my lane. But I know Salvi Deplito knows a lot about this. So I'll try to interview her and then I'll try to see how it goes from there. Next. Uh, okay. Kinan Kahiwat. Okay. What's the question? I hope some... Oh, it's long. Hi, Sir Marvin. I'm Keenan. I just wanted to say thank you. I collected all your investment books two years ago. And from there, I learned how to trade stocks and even forex. Congratulations to you. Uh, above that, I also discovered my passion in helping others, especially farmers in Bicol. I am now divested to cacao farming with, with the help of senior parents. We sell cacao tableas. We buy the beans from cacao farmers to help and give them another source of income. I hope someday when our business succeeds, I would like to volunteer in one of your blocks to share my learnings and you from you on the benefits of doing financial literacy and above all helping others thank you sir marvin uh by the way i'm only 27 congratulations so guys let's give a shout out to kinan kahiwat it's nice to see kids no younger I, i'm 36 i'm not he's also i guess we're both millennials but it's nice to see people younger than me do well it's nice to see uh people younger than me also uh somehow have a way for them to find extra sources of income that's not just purely employment but also into business as well and dami pang questions i normally get hundreds of questions a day or messages but i don't get to read them pasensya na uh pasensya na guys but uh, i'm trying to do as much as i can to help you and answer some of them in this video patrick james perez sir today baka you could help me to offer our property in laurel batangas 37 hectares you can add on top of our offer my name is patrick james perez and mobile number is 097 thank you so much and merry christmas so guys patrick james perez 
if you guys know anyone who wants to buy a property in Laurel, Batangas at 37 hectares, this is it. Ito na yun. Ma ma baka matulungan nyo siya. Um, public servants announcement also. Edric Yao. Hello po, Sir Marvin. I'm from I'm from the province. I've been planning to attend your seminars and technical analysis. But unfortunately, I've been very busy and just couldn't find time to be in Manila. Hopefully, next year, I will be able to be in one of your classes. I think the next one will be March 2020. Anyway po, I have a quick inquiry about the about the Pepsi Cola tender offer uh, from them because Lotte Chilsong Beverage is offering to buy 2 billion worth of the shares. Should I take the offer or should I top up? Also read from Paul that the risk of delisting. Is there any chance that Pepsi Cola, a company that has big shots down, sh shuts down its operation in the Philippines? Okay, here's what you need to know, guys. Please remember that uh, when a company delists, it does not mean that their operations will shut down. It just means also that uh, when a large amount of shares get sold by the main uh, by by the company itself, they have to also make a tender offer to uh, to the regular shareholders. That's normal. That's part of the game. And because also they will make a tender offer, of course their float will be lower. If their float will be lower, that will be grounds also for the listing. So here's the thing: if you believe in Pepsi and you believe in the growth of Pepsi over the next few years, and you want to be part of Pepsi still, and you want to receive their dividends, by all means, uh, stay with the company. But uh, if you want to get out already and you are in the stock market for liquidity, then better get uh, better get your uh, better get the tender offer so that you can use the cash and buy other stuff as well. So I hope I answered your question, but I I I I will try to do another video on the Pepsi tender offer specifically so that it helps address all of your questions. But please note, it doesn't mean that may tender offer magsasaring company. It doesn't mean that may tender offer something bad is happening to it. As well, so yon. Uh, someone gave his email. Uh, I won't read that na muna kasi it's just a specific email address. Helen Sanchez. Okay. Hi Marvin. How are you? I need your help, please. I I need a real estate agent to help sell my properties. There. A good, honest professional. Thank you. If you know someone, you can give her or him my Facebook account. So, guys, if you are a real estate broker, Helen Sanchez. Tulungan natin siya. Let's sell her account. Helen Sanchez, if you're if you're seeing this, please message me in Instagram uh, with all of the details so that I could I have a, I have a lot of broker friends. Let's see if they can help you out as well. Uh, Christopher Cabugos, good morning, Sir Marvin. Sorry to bother you, but I'm one of but I'm one of the research analysts from APSEC. We did a site visit on Ashana together. Sorry, but may I know your view on the property? And can I have a copy of a picture of all of us in the roof deck? Sige, Christopher, I will, I will. Uh, I'll, I'll send, uh, I'll send the, I'll send the picture here right after this. No, sorry, uh, if, if I know if Nico Shana, Nico Shana send, but I'll, I'll make sure that you get it also. Uh, I'll send it right now. Thank you, thank you. I'll say thank you. Okay. Then after that, uh, I'll make a video also on DM Wences Lao. So by the way, for those who don't know, uh, we were there. Uh, in DM Wenceslao just a few uh, days ago, we got to see Ashana City as a whole. They shared their plans. And I, I'll see if I can make a video off of it. I'll let you know also kung kaya and if I'll be able to make a video from that. Um, Nancy Man Han Pineda. Hello po sir. OFW po ako ngayon and currently interested in mag-invest sa stock market. Though wala po akong experience on how to start and how to do it, maybe you can help me start. Uh, Nancy Pineda, my suggestion is uh, go through the stock market basics playlist in YouTube. By the way, to everyone who's asking about the basics of the market, uh, I have over a hundred videos on the stock smart stock smart basic playlist. A lot of them uh, talk talk about all of the things that you need to know if you're starting out as well. And there you I guess that's it. Uh, this video is more than twenty minutes already. Uh, I'll try to make more over the next few days also. So, so yun. Uh, I guess that's it. I hope this is something that added so much content uh, to all of you guys. I hope this helped you and pushed you and nudged you also to help you reach your goals of financial freedom. If you guys like this format, no, that I get to read your questions. And the reason why I'm doing this is uh, maybe there are some of you who have the same questions that if it gets read out, you, it benefits you as well. That in one go, I get to hit two birds with one stone, whatever that analogy means. But 
yun, it helps me answer your questions na nakaka-reply naman din ako kahit pa paano. Pero kung di man ako nakaka-reply, pasensya na, there's just so much. And I have to figure out a way on how I could really reply to your to you, all of your questions. But yeah, uh, if you like this format, especially to those those of you guys in YouTube, the questions were from Facebook. But uh, reading those questions, I hope it's something that added so much benefit to you as well. So I guess that's it for now. Uh, Merry Christmas to everyone. So we're going to try to make another round of this Q&A video after after this but uh, but it will depend on also if you guys like this format because at the end of the day the videos that i do are intended to give you as much content but it's content that you like i don't want it to be boring i want i don't want also that's why if you notice it i'm i i just try to do the things that i love because uh i just love sharing uh, my ideas i just love sharing the things that i love to do the things that are dear to me and i hope that this makes you guys prosper as well so, this is Marvin Germo. I hope this video helps you trade well, trade strong, trade smart. Have a merry, merry Christmas, guys. I'll be in Korea in the next few days. So, expect uh, the vlogs, the videos to be in Korea talking about the market. So, see you all soon. Trade well, trade strong, trade smart. New cap, guys.